Hello Aries, welcome to your weekly forecast for the 7th to the 13th of April. Let's go ahead and have a look at your abundance, your love and your health for this week. Spirit, tell me a little bit about Aries and abundance. We have, you can't see something. Something is being offered to you and you can't see it. What is it? There is something there that you're, and I feel that you are kind of got the blinders on. It's like, I don't want to see. I don't want, it's a denial, okay? Let's have a look what that is. What is it, Spirit? What is it? What is uh, misfortune? It's, uh, okay. So it is this whole world situation that we're going through and where we've got blinders on. We're like, I don't want to know. I'm just focused here. I don't want to know about anything else. It doesn't exist. I'm in my bubble. No one can touch me. Nothing's in my bubble but me. And I feel that with you right now. I want my protective cocoon. And that is really where I exist right now. Spirit, tell me more about this. Because if you did, it would, it would be such a heavy burden. And I feel that you just you don't want to know. It's not part of you and it's like, I don't want to know. It's not me. I just want to actually pretend it doesn't exist. Tell me more about you, the lover. This could be you or this could be your person. But this is about abundance. <laughs> so I really want to focus on that. Maybe spirit doesn't want me to talk about it because he don't want to know. So... I'll ask again, and if spirit insists, I'll continue on to love. All right, spirit, tell me about Aries and abundance, main male. Okay, I'm not going to push it. Spirit is saying, let's talk about love. You have the lover twice. This could be you, or this could be your person. All right, so we're not going to talk about abundance because spirit saying Aries is focused on the bubble the cocoon I just don't want to know all right let's keep going spirit tell me about the lover tell me about the lover Ooh, you've got a wish come true ah that's nice uh, and you're keeping it to yourself I don't want anyone to know this is sacred knowledge just for me, something special. Uh, the lover, you've got your eye on. All right, or well, they've got their eye on you. Tell me more, tell me more. Tell me more about Aries and love this week. All right, so if it's like the fact maybe that your person is really attractive or has a lot of attention, uh, it makes you feel a bit anxious because your person seems to have, comp it's, it's competition, it's like I really want them to notice me but will they and you kind of think maybe I'll just sit in the background and I won't make a big deal but I really like this person and um, widower and death. So it's really, if this person gave you some attention, it would be the end to loneliness. This person is your end to loneliness. And this is how you feel. This is my person and this is my, my wish come true in every way possible. You want to be their friend. Maybe it's a friend and you secretly are in love with them. Okay. So, let's get some guidance from the Spirit. Tell me about what should enemies do. Ooh, all right. Tree, knowledge, wisdom, strength. So, I feel that knowledge is strength. you getting to know them. You're keeping all their information to uh, within yourself. And it's almost like everything you say it has a little memory bank, a little little filing cabinet just for them. Oh, they like this and they, they like wearing that and they smell like this and they like eating this and they like their coffee that way. Or, you know, you kind of keep everything in a little 
little safe spot in your in your heart <laughs> i was going to say in your mind but it's actually in your heart and you really adore this person i've got a couple of cards on the floor there i'll just get them for you and i feel that you're being very creative in how you're actually letting them know that you're interested in them you're just being very creative and um yeah you just sort of um you feel really really close to your person and absolutely keeping all the information about them to yourself because you don't really want you don't want to make a big deal and you don't want any opportunity for rejection it's like no nah, i don't want i don't want to cause any any trouble i don't want i don't want them to think that i'm making ripples or, or problems so i'm just going to stay in the background and admire them and think they're just the bee's knees but from afar and i i really see that here with you areas you don't want um, to risk i guess not not having what you have now with them which is really really cute <laughs> very very sweet all right so i'm going to ask again what should areas do what should areas do so spirit is saying yes you have hope you have hope that after this after this isolation hermit mode that we're all in that things will pan out okay and you know this is about fantasies dreams wishes this is a very innocent love and that's what i'm getting from your energy areas a very innocent sweet kind caring a real good intentions nothing nothing's you know i don't think you really want to cause any ripples like i said before you really just want everything to go smooth and you really want your person to maybe just get a vibe from you that's this i get a vibe like oh you're looking at me you're giving me some special looks today what's going on and you might be just like yeah i really like you but you don't want to sort of let them on let it out um too quick because you don't want any chance of losing the friendship that you that you've got which is so sweet all right so let's go ahead and have a look at your health for this week spirit tell me about aries's health for this week tell me about aries's health for this week so I've got a card here and it's a symbol for this virus and it doesn't mean anything about you. I'm going to ask why it's here, but I really feel that it's here because um, I think that it's just a concern that we're all going through. Okay, so this is the card and it's also the Knight of Wands. For some reason they're the two symbols unless i ask another question but because i asked about health this came up so let's go ahead and have a look spirit why do we have the devil card okay and i think like i said it's a concern that you have aries um and this is very much all about uh, you're worried that this is going to last a really long time and it's just not going to go I can assure you that this energy that's sweeping through right now is going to go um, it, it, can, it is a pandemic and it is quite serious and you know we are all doing the best we can to stick with ourselves and to and to take care of ourselves our hygiene and our loved ones of course and i feel that um you're just worried that it's just it's like why is it still hanging around you know we should be over this by now and i think this is something that's going on in your mind tell me more about Emmy's courtship and prevention and spirit is saying that um, also some of you may have started new relationships 
like for instance that crush that you've got on someone very special that you don't want to jeopardize anything with you just want to stay friends and you know maybe flirty friends um, but this is all about you know a possible relationship or maybe even that person that you admire and have placed upon a pedestal privileged lady okay type energy someone that you think of very highly um, and I feel that um, you're really kind of caring about them and really kind of I don't want anything to happen to my special person um, and I think this is really something that's coming out here spirit tell me more about this or because you love them this is beautiful you're in love with them and yeah you don't like I said you're thinking about them and you don't want anything to happen okay and I think you're really worried about those you care about and those you love around you spirit what guidance do you have for Aries in regards to this what guidance do you have again another symbol for that sickness so it's obviously something that's on your mind. It's on all of our minds, Aries. Tell me more about this for Aries. Pushing through, divine masculine, taking a chance. It, you know, it, it could also be, you know, you you really want to see your special person, and you know, spirit saying you're thinking of pushing through, taking a chance to see them or to be with them. But spirits also saying be very wary um, areas you know maybe not not to take any chances and and don't take any risks right now best stay home and I can see that you're really missing your person and you're worried about them and you're thinking about them and you're thinking about taking a chance and you don't want to let them go and spirit is war not warning but just saying you know do be very wary and do be very careful you know maybe um wait wait this whole situation out and um just you know let your person know that you do care and you are thinking about them and you know wait it through until all this is over and then you know go and see your person and it'll be all the sweeter after this is done um, and how long it's taken you know sometimes distance makes the heart grow fonder and I do feel you know that you do love this person so so much and you do want to be with them and you miss them but yeah you're thinking how long is this going to take how long am I going to have to wait to see my special person um, it's going to take a little while but it'll be over um, soon enough and you will be with your person all right i hope this helped areas and i hope it gave you comfort and love if you liked my video please like it and if you'd like to show me love and support on my channel please subscribe it actually supports me my livelihood on youtube and if you'd like a personalized version of this or any one of my mini readings they are $40 and you can book that at the email address that's in the description box below as always I send you love bye for now